the last thing I hear a lot is that buyers are like, you know what, I don't want to say the next few years is going to be great. I don't want to say the, the world's going to end. I just don't know. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to rent until I feel comfortable. And, you know, and, and that's fine. You know, that's, that's you just not feeling comfortable making a big decision. Purchasing a home is, is a huge decision, right? Financially. So um, that's, that's just a, a potential buyer saying, let me, let me sit this one out for a bit and I, I'll, uh, I'll come back to it when I feel more comfortable. Well, we now have programs for that. Uh, Coldwell Banker is partnered with Home Partners of America. And what they do is they give you the ability to rent a house that you would otherwise want to buy and you can decide with no, uh, with no uh, purchase obligation whether or not you want to uh, stay on the rental market or you want to buy. And this is great for this market because right, I'll fully admit I don't have a crystal ball. The market could go like this, the market could go like this, we don't know. So this option, I think, is a, a good compromise because what it does is you actually find a home that's on the market, that's for sale, all right? You like it, this, this group, Home Partners of America, of America, will purchase the property and rent it out to you, all right? And they'll rent it uh, for a minimum of one, maximum of three years here in the state of Texas. And what that does is in that three-year window, you can decide, do I want to purchase this at the agreed upon price? Because you get locked in at a certain price when you purchase it. So you can purchase it for that price now or three years from now or anywhere in between. Or do I want to say, hey, no, no thanks, too risky. Uh, I'll stick with the rental and maybe after three years you, you move out. Or maybe after one year you just decide to go to another rental. So this is kind of a, you know, like I said, it's a good compromise. Best of both worlds. In the short term, uh, you know, if the market goes like this, you get to purchase the property at any time you want to exercise it at the already agreed upon price. So instead of paying the market price as it rises, you get to pay, you know, the agreed upon price. If the market goes like this, you have the ability to back out and say, hey, uh, you know, I, I, I don't want to pay at that agreed upon price. Uh, I'm, I'm walking away from this. Uh, maybe I want to buy something else, which you have, again, there's no obligation. Maybe I want to buy something else, you know, at this price rather than this one at this price where it was, and you have that freedom. So whether it's uh, the interest rates are too high, the, the market is bad, the market will crash, or uh, I, I want to rent right now and wait and see what happens, there's a lot of options out there available. Oh, and, and one I almost forgot. So back to the interest rates are high. So a lot of lender, lenders are uh, uh, providing these uh, buy-down programs. There is a, let's not get this confused with a point buy-down. Um, so that, that's always been in effect where you're getting a loan, you wanna pay a lower interest, the lender will say, hey, I'll charge you X amount of dollars to get the rate reduced X amount of, of, of uh, percentage, right? And that rarely works out in your favor as long as you're uh, in the home for uh, you know the, the standard you know five seven years. Um, this is a little bit different. At the purchase of the property, you can actually get up to about 20k put into an escrow account that will uh, monthly it'll come out of that escrow account and help pay down your interest rate. So for instance. You can get it set up so, okay, interest rates are 7% right now. You can get it set up so that for the next two years, you're effectively paying 5% interest. And again, after two years, I fully expect interest rates to be back in the 5% range. So this is a, a great way for you to um, pay a lower, have a lower monthly payment and pay like you were paying that lower interest rate and kind of ride this high interest rate wave out so that you can get it back down to a reasonable rate. So I, I hope this was helpful. I hope this gives you uh, some ammo to at least get the conversation started, get the ball rolling on researching some of these things for, uh, for yourself so that you have the peace of mind that whatever decision you make to, to rent, buy, wait, stay put, that you make it fully informed. Um, uh, and until next time, um, I'd love it if you can uh, like or subscribe. 
uh, and um, I'll keep these informative videos coming at you so that uh, you'll be front of the line, top of the market when the time comes. Thank you very much.